What's up ghouls and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming another Spooky Box Club unboxing. I'm so freaking excited. This is my first Spooky Box Club unboxing in my new house. I'm very happy. I think this is the second video I've filmed here, so it's still super exciting every time I set up to film. Um, as you can see in the background here, I finally have my dressing table, so my little studio is pretty much complete. I just need to like hang my little decorations and pictures and stuff, and then other than that, I'm good to go. Um, yeah, hopefully I'll be uploading a video soon about the whole process of moving in and showing you clips of like us getting the flat, how we like it and stuff like that, so look out for that. <laughs> um, today's box is Elegant Fripperies. And I had to Google what a frippery was because I didn't have any idea. And it, so it says here, frippery is showy or unnecessary ornament in architecture, dress or language. So basically just over the top decorations. And that is something I will definitely enjoy, especially because it will be dark and spooky. So I love that and it'll be perfect to go in my new home. I don't know if you can see here because it's black on black, but I have my little picture frame from the last box on my vanity. I just haven't put anything in it yet. I don't have anything that small so I'll have to find something to go in there. But anyway, on with the video. So, elegant fripperies, let's go. can never open these boxes, they always package them really tight. information on it um, but it says box 27 and I'm not going to read it but there it is so we pull out the doodad things oh there's loads and I've just hoovered as well uh -oh. Ooh, exciting stuff okay so the first thing I've pulled out here is a little charm I'm not sure what this is oh it's because I was looking at the back of it <laughs> so it's in this tiny little bag Open it up. Uh, right. So I was looking at the back side and I was like, what on earth is that? I was like, is that like a weird chicken? No. It's a rose with some little petals and that's the charm to go on the charm bracelet. So that's really, really cute. The next thing is a choker. Looks like this. I'll take it out of the cellophane so you can see it better. really cute so it's black velvet here and then it says spooky box club at the top with two little moons next to it and then it's got this silver ornate metallic thingy here and then you thread this ribbon through so you can have like a little corseted collar which is super super cute and I might wear that today because that's really adorable Next thing is another lollipop, and this one is green and red. It's a bit Christmassy, but I'm sure it would taste good. I feel like that would taste of apples. Next thing I'm pulling out is a pin, and this is a death's head moth pin, which is super cute. And it's on this little lilac backing, and then you can see the little pin there. So pretty. I haven't put any of my pins on. Actually, no, on my purse, I have three pins, but I haven't added the recent ones, so I'll have to find somewhere to pop those. There's another thing here. It's another charm in a little bag. Open this up. And it's just a little droplet, and it's got a little black um, fake crystal in there, which is really cute. Oh, if you can stay still, then you can focus. There you go. So there's another charm to add. I've lost count of how many charms there are now. There's a lot, but they're all so cute. Next thing is in a giant bag. Oh my God, what is this? Okay, this looks exciting. I can see like tombstones and I'm in love. Right, so this says DIY graveyard jewelry hanger, ready to paint, stain or customize. So I'll take out the cellophane so you can see it again. So this looks like it was done on like um like a laser cutter. Oh my god, I can't open it. It's wrong with me, there we go. Nope, I closed it again. There's like the outline of like a graveyard, like little tombstones and stuff. 
and then you've also got here a little bag with little hooks that you screw into it so you can hang things off of it my god this is like Ikea with the DIYs and then there's this little pinky purple ribbon which I guess you would use to put through these top two holes so you can hang it and then you'd have your jewellery hanging off which is so cute I think I will be cliche and spray paint this black <laughs> and have it on my wall or I guess you could use like a like a white paint and add some little like detail into the tombstones which would be super cute oh my god I'm so excited to have that I might put it over there in my studio on the wall and it'll be so cute and then oh my god there's so much in this box oh my god this is cute so there's a little black pouch and inside is a necklace and so it's like a silver chain and on the silver chain is this little ring which attaches the next part onto it and engraved on the ring is you can see it oh this is so so fiddly uh, it says sbc for spooky box club which is so cute they've gone into like a lot of detail with that and then the main part of the necklace is the skull it's like quite a thick, heavy skull, so that's really cool. It's like good, sturdy necklace. The next thing, oh my god, this box never ends. They have outdone themselves with this box. Ooh, another necklace, and this one's slightly longer, so it's again, it's on that silver chain. And then at the end is a little bone, well, quite a big bone actually. That's so cute. Love that. That'll look really good, like paired with the the skull one, a little skull and a little bone. And then all the confetti is little. Oh, let's get it out. Like a little shiny skull and a little shiny bat. So cute. And then the last thing in here, I think, is a print and I'll take it out of the wrapping because otherwise it's too shiny. In the last few boxes there's been a print in every box which I really like because it means I have loads of decoration for my house. Um, so it's a print of, so it's purple on the back and then it's got all these gems and crystals on it. It's really cute and like cartoony and I love that. So yeah, super cute. Oh my god, I think that is everything. There's so much in there. Oh my god. Right, where is the card? There. So, Spooky Box Club Elegant Fripperies Box Number 27, Custom Made DIY Jewelry Hanger, yes, Custom Made Femur Bone Necklace, Custom Made Death's Head Moth Pin, Black Velvet Lace Up Choker, Custom Made Rose Charm, Custom Made Black Drop Charm, Custom Made Skull Necklace, Gemstone Art Print, and a Handcrafted Gourmet Lollipop. So, that is everything in the box. I think my favourite thing is either the bone necklace because that's so cute or the DIY graveyard hanger thing because that is just so cute. I love the little, how it's all gravestones in a little row. It's so cute. Um, yeah, so that is everything in the box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really love doing Spooky Box Club unboxings because not only do I get loads of like cool cute stuff but I also get to share it with you guys so it's really cool I forgot to mention at the start as well that I did my makeup in an elegant tone elegant tone elegant way zoom in on the eyes so I tried not to go super crazy with the eyes they're a little bit messy still but yeah I used the the meat matte trimini palette from the balm which was super cool and I'm wearing Kat Von D Exorcism on my lip and then this little elegant dress thing is from a vintage store and my headband is from Asda at Halloween or Tesco, I can't remember, one of the two but I've had it ages and I wear it a lot so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed that video, comment down below and tell me what the favourite thing was that you saw in this box and yeah, see you guys next time.